and my emotions were very high just to be a part of the team that uh, sitting in the firing room that day, you know, as the uh, assistant launch director and to watch her light up that day was so exciting. And of course, lifting off the pad, you know, it just like took my breath away. It was very exciting. I will never forget that moment. I have that, uh, I have had that proud parent moment for a lot of years with Atlantic. You know, we're, we're looking at the, uh, roughly 25 years ago when it came to Kennedy Space Center. And, and I think about, well, I had 13 of those 25 years that I had days, nights, and weekends with Atlantis. So yes, I feel like a parent to Atlantis. And uh, when I was selected as the flow director for OV-104 Atlantis, uh, that, was, that was probably one of the most exciting days of my life, I can tell you. It was, it was just like a dream come true. Uh, I was just over in the OPF a few weeks ago and walking around the vehicle and uh, it is just awesome to have that feeling, you know, of, of a relationship with a machine. And uh, a lot of people can't understand that, but when you spend as much time as I spent around that machine, uh, which is a beautiful spacecraft, it is a great relationship that I think I had with both the spaceship and with the team that was taking care of her constantly over those times that I was uh, in charge of that. When you get to know these guys and gals, you are just amazed that we have this level of people that are representing this country that, to me, was one of the highlights of my whole career. But that first flight after Challenger for Atlantis, that was an experience. And the flight crew was just so uh, courageous and, and so willing to give the commitment that everybody made to step up to the next level of safety. I think you listen a little closer, you're a little more attentive, and then of course when the engines light up, you know, and the vehicle rocks back, you know, that uh, seemed like a lot longer time than for a normal mission. It's just a few seconds, but those few seconds seem like forever. <laughs> If we look back uh, on the shuttle program, I think we're gonna recognize that this has truly been a milestone in American technology. But for me, uh, you know, it has been a very exciting ride to be able to be a part of this magnificent program.